there was just us together hoping that things would that would happen. Well, it all did happen and it's all real and it's no longer hope, it's it's happening now. Now it's hope for the new people that we're starting to share this with. But the first thing is, I, what I found was that uh, EXP had three major things different than any other company. One, they had the lead generation program that they provided for you that was you know, six to $10,000 a year if you were gonna buy it, and a lot of people did. Um, you come to EXP, you get that free. I mean, six to 10 grand right there off the top. That's a huge thing. And most really good, solid producing uh, agents, mega agents, all have a platform that they pay for, that they utilize, um, because there is a lot of communication back and forth. So to get that free is a huge, giant thing. And two, they have the opportunity to be able to have um, stock acquisition, which is a way to create um, uh, your nest egg, if you will, to create your, to create your, um, I don't know, your wealth building side. There's a whole bunch of different ways to acquire stock. And this is a publicly traded company on the NASDAQ, EXPI is the stock. I remember when we first got started, we hoped we would get on the NASDAQ. It wasn't on the NASDAQ yet. And then it was, when, it was, then when we got on it, we didn't really know what that meant. And now we know that, uh, I mean, what a, what a major difference it's made. So you can earn shares when you, when you sell your first house every year as, as an EXP agent. I mean, you're already selling houses. That's what you do, right? But now EXP gives you stock when you do your first transaction. We have an agent equity program that you can, it's a voluntary program. You don't have to do it, but I don't know any agent that's not a part of it. The, uh, it's the, that agent equity program where you can utilize 5% of your commissions on a monthly basis to purchase the stock at a 10% discount. That's an automatic win. And you can get you know, more, more, more stock as a result of that and more asset gain. And then when you cap, and that's when you gross 80,000, you paid 20% of 80, 16, you cap, you're at hundred percent, given more stock <clears throat> at that point in time, that's really great. And then we have the icon agent program that if you sell enough houses, we give you the whole $16,000 back. I mean, in stock, I mean, you think about that, all the money that you are paying your broker, you're getting back in stock. And I don't know any icon that between the ICON award program, the equity awards, the agent equity program isn't already making over 100%, making back more than the money that they are, um, that they are paying the company. And you're having that in an asset base that uh, gives you options and, and gives you a, you know, a potential retirement program. It's really, really, really awesome. And I have, a and I have one, one lady on my team that has already acquired over a million dollars in stock in four, less than four years, over a million dollars in stock. I have several agents that have earned 10, 20, 30,000, 50,000, 100,000, a couple hundred thousand. And I'm not saying that's what's gonna happen for you. However, what I found out was that people have done it. And if people have done it, other people can. If one done it, a hundred can do it, a thousand can do it if they want to, just making that decision. So that was a really big deal. And that's very exciting, especially to agents who've been in the business a long time and they're wondering how do I transition from being an active, um, <clears throat> hardworking uh, real estate agent to not having to do that later in my retirement years, if you want to call it. And then the next slide, if you don't mind, the next thing is uh, revenue share. And this is a way, because you have equity, you're an owner. So all the agents of the company have ownership equity in the company, right? We're all owners. And so we think different, we act different, we respond differently. We want to teach and train everyone because we know if they do good and they do better and the stock goes up, we win, right? Because we're all owners. So we're thinking, how can we improve this? How can we help everybody? It's not an us against them thing. It's a we, let's make this thing happen. And then the revenue share program, that is a way that the company rewards agents who decide that they want to attract or recruit agents. And I forgot to mention, by the way, in that stock part is that, um, if you attract and when you attract agents to the company and they join, when those agents close their first transaction, you earn more stock again. And there's no limit on the number of agents you can refer if you want to, that's voluntary. But that's another way to earn stock. Besides selling, you can earn more than you pay the company just by selling a lot, um, getting stock. And if you decide you want to refer agents and they're selling, you're going to earn more stock, no question. In fact, I'm really surprised that... Um, I believe that within two years, 
certainly of almost any agent joining the company, if they will take advantage of everything that's possible within the company, that there should be, they should absolutely be at over 100%. They should be making more money from their stock acquisition, from their revenue shares, that is greater than that 16,000, without, without a doubt in my mind that that can be done. And, and uh, so it always surprises me when, when people don't decide to pick up those options. But this re revenue share is revolutionary, right? Um, and the thing is, it's paid off the top, which is exciting. It's the referral fee, really, right? A series of referral fees. The company wants you to receive income, a share of the income, if you help the company grow, if you help it expand by getting good quality agents to join, right? And so um, it's a voluntary thing. You don't have to do it. I suggest that people make it as part of their business plan. It's not the only thing necessarily, but part of your business plan. When I was selling, um, when I was selling, I used to, my, my whole business plan was I want to get two listings a month. I spent all my time and effort to get two listings a month. And the reason I did that is because I knew that on average, I would get one buyer per listing pretty much, you know, based on the sign calls and things on average, some more, some less, but two. So I knew if I could get two listings, I'd probably also pick up two buyers. So I had a chance of having four closings a month, 50 closings or so a year. That was my goal. And, um, and I spent, like I said, all my time and effort, waking hours, doing that, making that happen. It was just me, didn't have a team or assistant. And, um, and the only thing that I looked at differently was if I could get two listings a month and two buyers a month, I believe I could get two agents a month. And so I started wanting to show one or two agents a week, at least. If I did one or two listing appointments a week to list houses to sell, I would want to do at least as many agent listing appointments, if you will. That's what I call it, you know, listing appointment to get a house to sell or a listing appointment to enroll an agent. It's just the way I look at it. Um, and so when I first saw this, I said, okay, this is really cool. Let's assume that you're an agent and you invite me, the way this works, you invite me to take a look. And I see this and I go, I think this is really pretty cool. I'm going to join eXp. I move my license to eXp. And when I sell a house, I'm going to pay my 20% to the company, right? Just like everybody does. And because you enrolled me, you're my sponsor, you get three and a half percent and the company gets 16 and a half percent. And you get that up to $2,800 a year of the 16,000 that I pay. If I pay the full 16, you're gonna get 2,800. If I only pay in 8,000 because I didn't do as much volume, then you're gonna end up with 1,400. But you're gonna get three and a half percent of the gross commissions that I create every year that I'm with eXp and so are you. I've been licensed off and on since 1983. I know a lot of real estate agents, right? So I refer other agents. In fact, I figured I could, um, you know, refer 5, 10, 15, 20. I think it's been four years now, 50 months. I've referred over 100 agents personally who've joined, 100. And, and people think, wow, that sounds like an awful lot. Not really. It's two a month, you know, 51 months, 52 months, something like that. I've been with the company, my wife and I. And um, two a month, I average, some more, some less, you know, depending on the month. Um, 100 is just what it is. And those, those would be your second level, all the people that I enroll. And you get up to $3,200 a year on the agents that I bring to and anybody who's on your second level, right? And then if they, if those agents bring on people, they're on your third level and you get up to 2,000 and so on and so on. We track that seven generations. And the way to unlock those payments, which I think is really cool, is that column over there, second to the left, that says personally sponsored agents. And what that means is, and what it shows is for every five agents that you personally enroll, it unlocks another level that you can get paid on, right? So, you know, I figured if you enroll people who enroll people who enroll people, it's just going to happen naturally. And it does. Um, some do more than others. Some do quicker, some do slower. It doesn't matter, but it happens. And I figured when I saw this, you got to get 40 agents to get paid through the seventh level all the way through. And when I first saw this, I thought, man, 40 seems like an awful lot. I will never get to 40, but I could see 25. I don't know why I could see... I could see 25, but 40 looked like that would never happen. And so my goal when I first started on this deal was, I believe that I could get one agent a month to join, right? One agent a month. And um, I figured if I showed one or two agents a week or had them join, you know, jump on a webinar like this, not me talking or someone else talking, whoever, get them on a webinar. If I can have one or two agents a week see this, I figured one would join most likely, right? 
And if I did that every month, that'd be 12 months, 12 agents in a year. I figured two or three would quit because people quit stuff all the time. They just do. And so I'd maybe net nine agents a year. That was my big goal, right? And if I did that for three years in a row, which is the vesting period for the stock, I would have 27 agents personally enrolled net after three years. So I was like, I wanted to like think like Covey, beginning with the end in mind. What is it going to look like three years from today? Not today, this week, this year, but three years from today. I would have 27 agents personally enrolled, which is more than 25, but less than 40. So I would qualify for those first six levels. And I figured that those agents would refer other agents, would refer other agents to the tune of 500 agents in three years. And I thought that was very doable because 20 years ago, I did it with Keller Williams and I referred 30 agents that joined in my first six months with Keller Williams. And that turned into those referred others, referred others, it turned into thousands and thousands of agents. And it has made me uh, a few hundred thousand dollars a year in profit sharing from Keller. And I realized that, wow, if, if, if that were, in fact, they tell me today, I, I think this is amazing, but they tell me today, I'm still like the 13th or 14th highest paid person in all of Keller Williams history in profit sharing which to me seems odd because I haven't been with them for 14, 15 years, something in that neighborhood. And um, I, you would certainly think that a ton of people would pass me after activities in 15 years, but just didn't seem to happen. So I, I didn't realize that. I, I thought, you know, it was decent for me, but I thought it was way better for everyone else. Turns out it really wasn't what I thought. And so when I saw this, I said, okay, I'm going to have 500 agents. And I thought I'd be really, really conservative, right? I figured that the agents I brought on board would not be seller, would not be superstars, because you know uh, they would just be people that did a million dollars in volume, one million, right? And, and I would say, how many houses in your market does it take to sell a million dollars worth of uh, property? And uh, in the Dallas area, it's like three, maybe four. In uh, I, I was talking, you know, if, if the average sale price is two hundred fifty thousand, then it's going to take you four. I was talking with a guy. Uh, in Seattle the, uh, this week, earlier this week. And I said, so how many uh, uh, houses does an agent have to sell here in Seattle to close a million dollars in volume? And he said, one and a half. <laughs> I go, that's unbelievable. You know, I mean, just, it's hard to relate. In Kansas, you have to do a few more, right? And so, but I said, just a million. That means I don't have a superstar team. I've got a bunch of people that are average to mediocre, put it that way, or very part-time, okay? No superstar agents. And, but they're grossing $30,000 a year in gross commissions if they're doing it at 3%. Well, EXP pays us 3.5% of that. 3.5% of $30,000 is a little over $1,000. So I figured I'd be making eh, $1,000 an agent, plus or minus a little bit, depending on you know where you are, um, a year in rev share based on the system. And I figured if I could have 25 agents on my first level, which means I qualified through the first six, and if those agents brought agents to a total of 500, which I thought was doable, because you know what I'd done in Keller 20 years ago, I realized those numbers make it. Um, that'd be $500,000 a year in residual income. And I figured, well, that was worth going for. And I literally came out of retirement for that, for the stock and for revenue share. Number one, revenue share, number two, stock. And the fact that it would affect other people's lives, because Gene Frederick, the fellow that showed this to me initially, he said, this is not just another real estate company. It's a whole new platform that is going to dramatically change the real estate industry through technology, especially the way agents are compensated. And he said, I know that you were able to get free because of what you did at Keller, but not everybody's been, not very many people do that. How many people are your friends been able to do it? And I said, well, none, none. And he said, well, this is a chance for you to be able to help your friends get financially set, get financially free. He said, I believe this is going to change the industry, not just in this country, but around the world. And it's unbelievable. But six, about four years ago, when we all got when we got started, there was about 600, maybe 800 EXP agents in the whole, you know, total. And they'd been at it for like six or seven years. In the last four years, we've gone from six or 800 agents to over 28,000, almost 30,000 agents. That is an unheard of growth. That has happened. Now, I was hoping to get 500 agents, and I thought it would take three years to do that. But it turns out that I ended up in my first year with over 700 agents in the first year, 
and I was enrolling two a month. In the second year, I just kept rolling two a month, right? And, and but those 700 became 3,000. And then in the third year, those 3,000 became 7,000. I just kept enrolling two a month and telling agents, why don't you just think on, you know, two a month or one a month, whatever, you know, some did, some didn't, some looked around. And before you know it, it was thousands and thousands and thousands of agents. And it was creating a seven figure residual. I mean, way beyond anywhere that I thought would happen. Now, the exciting thing is that I've now have uh, eight or 10 or 11, something like somewhere in that neighborhood of agents now on the team that are also making over a million dollars a year, some two or three. In fact, this last month in March, we just had another graduate who just earned over 85,000 in a month, which means if he continues that, that's a million dollars. He's on track for a million dollars a year. I'm excited about that. My goal is that a hundred people on the team and y'all are on the team. One of you may do this here, this on here, maybe a couple of you, is to create a hundred people making a million a year in revenue share. That's a big goal of mine. I just, I know it can happen. And like I said, we've got eight or 10 now. I know we're going to have, you know, a hundred in time. Why? Because we only have, we have 28,000 agents. That's less, that's a little more than 1% of the agent base in the United States and Canada. There's, there's almost 2 million, I'm told. And in the world, 5 to 10 million, a huge number of real estate agents worldwide as we're starting to expand. And now you can enroll agents anywhere in the United States, most of Canada, pretty soon it'll be all of Canada, Newfoundland, Great Britain, all the areas of Great Britain and Australia. And I know we've got five or six or seven more countries that were going to come online this year till this COVID deal showed up and that slowed things down and we'll have to work our way through it. And by the way, we will work through it. This too shall pass. It's not good, it's bad, of course, it may get worse, but it will pass and we will continue on. And I think that this is probably the best time you could ever to sow seeds and share this opportunity and have people check out what EXP is all about. Because a lot of people have heard of EXP, but they haven't seen EXP. They haven't, and they certainly don't understand it. And what I have found is that um, crisis creates opportunity. And like Winston Churchill once said, don't let a good crisis go to waste. Let's not waste a good crisis. Winston Churchill said that during World War II. You know, and I believe the same thing now. I believe that this is the best thing I've ever seen. We've seen agents' lives change dramatically, and we've seen it in a very, very big way. And I'd like to take the time right now, if Wilco, if you are handy right there, would you just say a couple of words of like, you know, what's happened with you and what you've seen? And because I know that you are, you're uh, the beginning of, of all this. We used to, we got started early together. Are you there, Wilco? I am. <clears throat> I am. I was eating lunch, so I, I figured people probably don't want to see me eating lunch <laughs> while I was listening. So I but I've been here the whole time. <laughs> yeah, you know, <clears throat> um, I had just gotten my license. Uh, I had uh, started a youth soccer club uh, and, you know, I, I, Juan and I, that's how we know each other. That's how I know Bettina. Juan and I played professional soccer and I started coaching and I started really building new soccer teams and, and a soccer club and all that stuff. But at a certain point I was working 60, 70 hours a week. I was just totally burnt out. And um, I got my real estate license cause I wanted to have leverage. And uh, we had accumulated a couple of rental homes and I saw that we were really benefiting from just two having two rentals and positive cash flow and building wealth. So, you know, I start, I read a book called Robert Kiyosaki and, and Rob, you alluded to it where, you know, most agents, they are self-employed. You know, they, they, if they step away from their business, their income stops. So that was kind of the same thing I was in. And so I met Rob uh, through real estate, obviously, and really intrigued with his, his profit sharing. And I asked him, can you teach me how to do this with profit sharing? He's like, well, I can, but it's going to take you a little bit longer than it did me. And so we kind of left it there. A couple of months later, he calls me up. He's like, hey, don't you have your real estate license? And I said, yeah. And um, he said, well, you need to check out this program called EXP. And I, I remember asking him, are they part of the board? And he says, yes. And I'm like, what's the cost? 85 bucks a month. All right, I'm in. That was, <laughs> that was basically Rob's amazing recruiting skills. <laughs> I've gone downhill from there. <laughs> 
And then, uh, so, because I wanted to accumulate rental properties, so I wanted access to the MLS, blah, 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 blah. And um, <clears throat> then a couple of months later, he says, hey, listen, you need to really check out this revenue share. So he explains the whole revenue share thing. I'm like, why didn't you explain this to me at the, from the start? <laughs> and um, so, uh, you know, and, and really, I, I, he asked me, do you know a couple of real estate agents? And I really didn't. And I really didn't think this was going to work. So I called Juan and Bettina and we met and they really liked it. And I just kind of slowly started building from there. And I mean, I remember thinking <clears throat> if I can get, you know, a thousand, if I can generate a thousand dollars a month in passive income, that would be life changing for me. That would be a mortgage payment, a car payment. And, you know, I really didn't think this was going to work. And it's just been unbelievable. I mean, my revenue share group is over 800 agents in 25 different states. And, you know, we have a system in place that, that Rob's created with Gene. And if you follow the system, you, you, you can't fail. You just can't fail. It will work. And so just follow the system. And it's been life changing. We, I now go on at least four vacations per year with my family. We're building an addition at, in my house, uh, second story. And we live by the lake. And it's beautiful, you know. And, and it's, it's, it creates a whole nother world that you just have no idea exists. And you don't, you, you know, we all have these mental barriers that we kind of struggle to break through. We have a, like these income barriers, right? That we believe, oh, we are, we can only earn this amount. The reality is, is that there is no limit to how much income you can earn. And, and it all stems from uh, helping other people succeed, you know, and, I'm probably going on longer than I should, but I'll finish with this. You know, Rob's goal is not, hey, I want to have, you know, $100 million a month. It stems from how can I help other people become millionaires through this system? So it's all about how can you bring value to other people first? And as a result, you automatically get rewarded for that. And that's just a beautiful thing. I don't know any other platform that can do that. It's, it's just incredible. So thank you, Rob, and, and thank you, Bettina and Juan, for uh, going on the journey together. And uh, yeah, it's, it's been life-changing, absolutely. Thanks, Wilco. I really appreciate that. And Bettina, I, I appreciate you um, and where you've come and what you guys have done for your family, you and Juan. And, and really, I've seen a, a massive change in your lifestyle as a result of this. And, uh, and I want to shout out to say hi to... Uh, uh, Lewis and Lori Rios, and I want to say hi to Jamuna, who I've seen. I, I see your smiling face there, and um, I'm excited. I'm excited for the growth. I'm excited for where you can go and and uh, where this is taking you all, and I'm going to turn it back to you, and I'm going to say goodbye because I have actually another group that is waiting for me uh, to say hello. It's, uh, it's real interesting. People have picked up the... Uh, the desire to say, you know what, now is the time. Why wait? I've got some time now. Um, people are sitting down. People are more open now. I think they'll be open for a while to uh, um, to be able to increase their income, to find out a different way, a better, more smoother way. Um, because we're virtual and NEXP has been virtual for uh, 10 years now, uh, interestingly enough, nothing changed. We didn't miss a beat. We didn't slow down. Checks still happen. Uh, accounting still worked, marketing still went. Um, people were already working out of their homes, doing virtually. Um, this whole pandemic really didn't do anything to stop our business operations, if you will. It may have affected how real estate agents can show properties and that type of thing, but enough things are happening and uh, you know around the country. And, and we, like I said, we are working our way through this. Um, and other real estate companies, other agents are seeing that we didn't skip a beat and all these other companies were going, oh my gosh, what do we do with our building? How do we touch with our people? How do we talk? How do we communicate? You know, they were really at a loss. Uh, you may see a lot of other real estate companies go down, shut their doors. Um, now's the time to talk to brokers and realtors uh, about the safe haven of EXP. I believe EXP really truly is a safe haven for uh, real estate agents and real estate brokers. Um, uh, without question, without a doubt. And it's going to be, you know, join us, you know, be Netflix or be Blockbuster, your choice. And I think they're starting to see, you know, 
that we're really proving what we said, what we talked about when it was our little group, five or six people. And we thought, wow, this would be really great. And now that's expanded and blown up to almost 28,000. And uh, man, thank you for all. I appreciate everything that you've done. And I'm proud to be in business with every one of you. And I look forward to doing this again, um, you know, with Jamuna and, and, um, and all of you here. So have a really great day. I'm gonna say goodbye, adios, and um, be safe and uh, be productive, be the best you you can. We'll see you, bye-bye. Thank you, Rob. Thank you, Rob. You're Thank welcome. You. So guys, here's what's so cool. Rob is at the place in his life, he doesn't have to do this anymore. He does this to give back to us. He still is contributing to us because this is who he is as a person. And I think um, those of us who are on this call who are already at EXP, you're the same type of people because this is our tribe. These are the type of people that we attract are the type of people who are who want to give back anyways. So when, just know when you start making your million dollars a year in revenue share, please continue to give back because that's who we are. And it's so much fun. So I'm gonna finish this up. I wanna respect you guys time. If you have any questions, I know we went through that really fast. You, you probably have a lot of questions and there's so much more that we'd love to share with you. Get with the person that invited you here today, okay? They loved you enough to invite you in the first place. They would be your sponsor, okay? So get with them and um, they'll connect you with us. They'll answer any questions they can. They'll connect you with us. They'll get the questions. Well, if there's any additional questions we can't answer, we'll get the information for you. We, we'll call Rob, we'll call Gene, we'll call Jason, the president. It doesn't matter. We'll make this work for you right now. And we're so excited. And thank you so much for your time. And um, if y'all ever need anything, don't hesitate to reach out to any of us. That's what we're here for. Talk to you soon. I'm going to unmute you guys, all you guys so we can all say goodbye because that's like my favorite thing is when we can all say goodbye, okay? Or hi. All right. Bye, guys. Bye. 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 Thank you, guys. See ya. Great weekend. Oh, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be 85 degrees. It's going to be yeah. cool today. Woo! Yeah. Bye, guys. I'm See having you. a pool party. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Oh, so cool. Uh, Up in the lake. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Hey, I love those videos. Cool.